What's your excuse? Hey doing YouTube, it's Will from Real Development. This is my 59th weekly update. I'm gonna jump right into it, try to keep it kind of quick. So my weight this week has been averaging 165, if you recall, it was 164 and a half last week, so I've gone up a half a pound. Still averaging around eight, seven point eight percent body fat. So right where I want to be, I'm bulking exactly how I want to, and I, it's nice because I get to actually splurge a little bit. I've had cheese for the first time in like months. I, I like to tell myself not to eat certain foods and then I get to go back and eat them. Oh, it's awesome. I really like cheese. It's a big deal for me. I like all dairy. That, that, and workouts. Workouts this week have gone great. I am looking forward to the deadlift because my deadlifts have been progressively getting better and better and better as I focus more and more on my form. I see my strength in, in them getting better and no back pain when I'm done with them, which means I'm doing them properly. Bench press, a uh, little offset this week, a little upset this week, but uh, I was only able to crank out about 12 and a half-ish maybe 13 reps with contest weight, which last week I did a lot better than that. I think I was just having an off day on Wednesday. But to uh, punish or make up for that fact, what I did was I did um, drop sets. And actually I just did a burnout drop set basically. I did 155 and then I just, I was so angry I couldn't do anymore. So I stripped off 10 pounds and then just boom, 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 boom until I couldn't do any more and then stripped off 10 more pounds, boom boom, until I couldn't do any more. Until I had nothing left but the bar and I did that for like 50 and just totally burned out and my shoulders as well as my chest is feeling it still today. And today is Friday as you know. And today's workout was great. It whooped my ass great. I was able to do one round with five gallons of water which I forgot I was going to plan. I was planning on keeping four gallons this week. Went to do the second round with four gallon, five gallons. It didn't work out. I couldn't even pick the thing up. It was just I was too weak after it. So, dropped back down to four gallons in the barrel. The farm's handle still sticking at 128. Still feeling good. Still feeling strong with that. I can pick it up easily every time, and I can move with it and pretty well stop with it if I had to, with uh, with not a lot of a lot of uh, effort. And I'm up to 120 on. The clean and press did four rounds of it tonight. Total time was about, uh, let's see, I can actually do it right now. Four, eight, seven, seven, eight. It's about, uh, about 27 minutes total. Total time uh, when you put all four of the rounds together, which I'll do four rounds again next week, except I'll be doing it with 130 on the clean and press. Probably going to keep the five gallons in that barrel. And probably going to go up another 5 pounds or 10 pounds on the farmer's carries as well. Real quick, it is November. We are six days into November, in fact. So I put a video up of me shaving the shavening. And if you didn't see it, I'll put a link to it down below in the description. Check it out. Uh, in that video, there's a link to the official Movember website. It's a great cause. Just grow out a mustache for the week of Mo November to help raise awareness for men's health issues. And if you go to the official website, you can actually start like a team and donate money towards causes. I can't honestly say whether or not they are using the money for good things, but they have articles on their website about all the things that they use their money for. I myself haven't done a lot of research, honestly, because I donate my own money. I don't go out and raise money. Um, I plan to one day, but right now I'm just doing it for me. I usually donate 10, 15 bucks. Every little bit counts in any campaign or fundraising effort. So 
keep that in mind. Every mustache counts. Women can help with it too. They, I think they refer to them as Mo Sisters or something like that. I don't know. I like the idea of being able to grow out a mustache on November since I usually stay pretty clean shaven most of the year. Or I grow out the Wolverine. So, that's about all I got to say this week. Uh, I will be dropping new video next week and the following week 100% for sure because I already have them uploaded so I just have to make them public which means you'll get to see them and I don't have to keep making promises that I don't keep. So look forward to that next week. As always, thanks for watching. Keep progressing. And if you don't check out the Movember video, then what's your excuse?